ladies and gentlemen, I'm Matt Thiesfeld here on Millionaire's Lounge with our uh, first-time contestant, Dane Nielsen. Say hello, please. Hello, everyone. I'm going to explain the game here quick for you. We have three categories. We have entertainment, sports, and food. Higher the points, the harder the question will be. You also have this Ask the Expert card, which is if you get stuck on a question, you can ask Mr. Hansen back there, along with uh, one minute on a Google search on the iPad if you need that. Do I have an iPad available? Right there for you. Okay, all right, thank you. And then you get three strikes, and after that third one, you go to a final question where you are able to bet however many points you have at the time, which will be right. doubled if you get it correct, or you'll lose them if you get the question wrong. <laughs> all right. So uh, with that, we'll uh, get started here with the first question. All righty, here we go. Let's see. Uh Let's go entertainment. Uh, we'll just go 100. All right, entertainment for 100 points. What movie is Camp Crystal Lake from? Camp Crystal Lake, what movie? Boy, I don't know. Camp Crystal Lake. Holes? Holes is his answer. That's not correct, though. Friday, Friday the, the 13th. 13th. I'm not a big Friday the 13th fan, so. That's all right. Yep. All right, go ahead with the next one. All right, well, obviously I didn't do so well with entertainment. I better go to sports. Oh, yeah. <laughs> How many points? 100. Sports for 100 points. How long is an NFL quarter? 15 minutes. 15 minutes is his answer? And that is correct, so you uh, have a total of 100 points now. Very nice job getting that one knocked out of there. All right. Let's see, let's, uh, let's, let's go to the other uh, category. Was it food? Food, let's go food for 100. Food for 100 points. Yeah. This is a bonus one, so this will be multiplied by two, if you get it correct. So 200. Better ingredients. Better pizza. What? Uh, whose slogan is that? Uh, Peyton Manning's good friend, Papa John. Papa John. That is correct. Very good. So that's 300 points total now. Let's uh, let's stick with food and let's go food for 200. Food for 200 points. This fast food restaurant slogan is "Have it your way." Have it your way. Oh yeah, this is, uh, why am I having a, I'm totally drawing a blank here. That's terrible. That's have it your way. Let's see. 38 seconds. Oh, I have 38 seconds. Well, can I use, can I use my Google, uh, search? I'm going to use my Google search here quick. Alrighty. It's going to pop up into my brain here. Can I just grab this and go? Yeah. Right. I have to hold on to all this stuff while I Google search. <laughs> I don't know about this game show. <laughs> is it really Burger King and I couldn't figure that out? That's terrible. Have Burger, it your way, Burger King. Burger yeah. King is what he came up with. Yeah, and that's it because Google told me so and yeah. Google's always right. There's 200 points for you, but uh, you do not have that iPad anymore, so remember that. Okay. These next couple questions. So you're up to 500 points. Uh, let's let's go back to how many do, am I going to go through all of these? Your goal is, yeah, your goal is to. My get, goal is to. to go okay. Through all of them. All right. Again. All right. Let's uh, let's go to entertainment for 200. Entertainment for 200. What TV show is about a chemistry teacher who makes drugs? I don't watch TV. I'll ask the expert, because... All right, Mr. Hansen. What TV show is about a chemistry teacher who makes drugs? I think it is, but I don't watch enough TV. I've, I just heard... Is it the Breaking Bad? I think it is. I've never seen it before, but we're going to go with Breaking Bad. All right, Breaking Bad And I'm Bad keeping this, because he didn't help me. No. Breaking Bad is correct. So, oh, good. All right. Uh, it's 200 points, but you have no help anymore, so this is all up to you Okay. with these next questions. All right. 
me. I better skip entertainment. I don't even. Let's go sports 200. Right, sports for 200. How many NFL teams are in New York? Ooh. We'll have to make sure here. Uh, let's see. I know the Giants, of course. But do the Jets, you know, there's the New York Jets, but are they, do they count? Because they play in New Jersey, I believe. Okay. That, that counts. I got to think, is there anyone else there off the top of my head? Jets, Giants. Oh, jeez. 22 seconds. I don't, I, 22 seconds, Jets, Giants. Jim Kelly, Bills, 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 Buffalo. That's all I can come up with. I don't. I, right, three, three, three is the number. Three is his answer. I don't. And that is correct. The Bills, the Giants. I was thinking and Jim Kelly. Jets. I am watching that O.J. Simpson show on FX now. I said I don't watch TV. I, I enjoy that just because oh, yeah. that was around my OJ time. You know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a pretty good show. Heard that. Was good. Yeah. yeah. All right. That was oh. 200 points there. So you're up to 900. All right. Thanks. Let's go. Uh, food 300. Food for 300 points. This fast food restaurant was the first one to put cheese in the crust. Pizza Hut? Pizza Hut is his answer. I have no idea. Pizza hey, Hut. Hey, that is correct. Okay. Right? That's a good one. 300 All right. points there, so you have to 1,200. So there's no strikes here. I got to refresh my memory on the rules. Am I going to be out if I keep getting wrong? No, two more strikes left. So I'm going to stay away from entertainment because I'm terrible at that. So let's go back to sports. All righty. Uh, 300. Sports for 300 points. How many MLB teams are in Canada? Uh, Toronto. Montreal no longer exists. Toronto. Blue All Jays. Right. One. One team. Toronto Blue Jays. And that is correct. 300 points. So you're up to 1,500 oh, points. Boy. Doing pretty good now that you uh, got that one entertainment strike. Yeah. Uh, We're not going back to entertainment until the end here. Let's go to sports 400. Sports for 400. I just points. want everyone to know I won sports trivia this morning on KDOM. KDOM. <laughs> what did you win? Uh, Subway. Subway. Six-inch Subway gift card. So. All right. This boxer's nickname is Money. Ooh. got to be newer is that that's uh probably floyd it's probably mayweather floyd mayweather i'm guessing is that mayweather yep yeah that is correct Ooh, lucky because that usually i only know the old time ones there just, just just so everyone out there understands to our expert mr hansen has won numerous times on sports trivia he's a sports trivia guru he's on kdom quite frequently at 7 13 in the morning He had, he had said that one before. I remembered that one from a past. I think I answered it last year around this time, actually. That's why I was able to get it. Oh, sorry, sports. <laughs> 500? Is that what's next? Yep. Sports for 500 points. How many teams, NBA teams, are in Canada? Well, we have the Raptors of Toronto. And one. Raptors. One. Toronto Raptors. That is correct. Yep. Just one team on that one. That's a nice question to get out of there. 500 points. All right. Let's. 2,400 is your score as of right now. Uh, let's wrap up sports here. So, sports for 1,000 points. Ooh, that's How a good question. Are I can think about it. tour players allotted per shot? Well. It's not enforced. Uh, I'm going to guess here. I don't even know, actually. F 40 or 45 seconds. Uh, I suppose I have to come up with one there, huh? Yeah, it's just one. 45 is what I think it is. All right. 45 seconds is his answer. And that is correct. Oh. So a nice. Uh, Thank you. Or it was, there. yeah, I've, I've heard that before. I couldn't remember if it was 40 or 45. All 30, right. 3,400. All right. Let's go to let's go to food. Stay away from entertainment. Food for? 400. 400 points. 
This fast food restaurant is home to the original chicken sandwich. Original chicken sandwich? Chick-fil-A, I don't know. Chick-fil-A, I'm thinking. Don't know that. Oh yeah, that is. Oh, it's a good one. I didn't. Yeah. I didn't even know that one. Wow. So Chick-fil-A for uh, 400 points there. So you're up to 3,800 there. If, if I get get anything wrong, am I losing points? No. No. Oh, okay. Well. But just strikes. Yeah. Just strikes. Just strikes. Out. Let's go. Food 500. Food for 500 points. This fast food restaurant has the Tex-Mex Bacon Thick Burger. It's a very good burger, I will add. Um, <laughs> Hardee's. Hardee's. That is correct, 500 points. So you're up to 4,300. It's pretty good. Almost got this whole food category knocked out. Let's so. wrap out food here for 1,000. All righty. This fast food restaurant is known for putting Bible verses on their cups. Oh. Bible verses on their cups. Hmm. I'm out of help. Yep, you're out. No help. So this is all on you. <laughs> Bible verses on their cups. Fast food restaurant Bible verses on their cups. Jimmy John's, I don't know. I have no idea. Jimmy John's is his answer? They don't have anything on their cup, so it's not Jimmy John's. In and Out Burger. In and Out Burger. I've even eaten at In and Out before. That's a tough one, you know. Those are only down south for the yeah. most part. Okay. All right, you got two, two strikes, strikes, so All one right. more. You have to go to that final question. So just entertainment now. Let's go to a thousand. A thousand entertainment. How many Goonies are there? This is kind of unfair question. I mean, are, is this like the original, like Goonies to start? Because you know they add in as it goes on. That's not. I don't. This personally, I don't know who came up with this question, but it's not fair. <laughs> uh, you know, it isn't total Goonies at the end of the movie. I mean, so you're talking data, everybody, and you're talking. Yeah, you're talking all of them at the end then. Now, does sloth, does sloth, my question is, does sloth turn into an original Goonie? You, you know, I just, where are we coming from with this question? That's a good question. Does the sloth, I, you know, chunk? Well, that, you know, and I, I, I'd have to sit and count. I mean, it is, right. it's one of, well, you're going to have to extend that, and that, that time shouldn't start when I'm asking these important questions. I mean, let's see, okay. Just stop the time because that's not fair. Okay, good. Now I got to start over with my count again. Okay. If you're counting sloth, eight. Eight with sloth. Seven, so. Did you count sloth in that at the end? Be honest with me. Oh, hey, we'll, we'll give you. But couldn't you say he, but I yeah, mean, at I, the end, I definitely you know, agree. We'll have to give so him. That's what I'm saying. Are you going to count sloth or not? We'll okay. have to give you the points there. Well, I just, uh, that was my only question, yep. is if that sloth was going to be in there. And then, you know, the you have the girls. And then, you know, so I don't know. You know, Mikey is the, you know, uh -huh. whatever. Okay, sorry. So that's 1,000 points. He got right. that one right. All right. Entertainment, let's go 500. Entertainment for 500 points. This is a bonus, so this is going to be multiplied by two, so another chance at 1,000 points here. Okay. What movie is the line, Yo, Adrian, I did it, from? Do I need to be specific with Rocky number or just Rocky? It's Rocky. Just it's Rocky. Rocky. Yeah. That's correct, so that's 1,000 points there. So you're up to 6,300, which is pretty good. All right. Almost the highest of all time, but he hasn't even gotten to the final question yet, so... 400 here, I guess, for entertainment. Entertainment for 400. This hip-hop artist is known for using the number six. Oh, he is. Actually, I can't give you any hints. Hip-hop artist for using number six. Drake. Drake is his answer. I don't know. 
That is correct. Very well-known guy. Very good artist, big time. Sure, yeah, yeah. All right, so 6,700 points. If you points. like that hotline bling. Yeah, hotline bling. Cha-ching. All right, we're down to the last question. We're going to be an entertainer for 300 points. All right. What actor owns film company Happy Madison Productions? One of my all-time favorites, Adam Sandler. Adam Sandler's answer. And that is correct. He is, he is the first person to uh, answer all those questions or uh, complete all those questions without getting three strikes. But he still has the final question left where you can bet all your points, some of your points, none of your points, whatever you want to do. All right. Um, what's the uh, top score ever? You already beat it. 6,400 was the previous best score. 6,400. That seven looks really pretty, okay? All right. Do I need to tell you how much I'm betting or can I hear the... Should I write it you down have, somewhere? You have to, you have, yep. Well, I'm not betting because I'm just going to keep this top score for now. Okay, so you I just want to bet. kind of wussy-like, but no, I'll go 100. 100 points? Yep. So we can go to 7,100 or 6,900. <laughs> All right, here comes that final question. All right. How many days are in July? That is the question. Is there a trick question, or it's 31? But 31. 31, I believe, is correct. Yes, yeah. that's the final question. So technically, you get double what you just bet. Yeah. So you get 7,200. Okay, that's fun. So, uh, well, there you go, folks. Top score here, Dane Nielsen. Thank Shake you. Shake my hand. A lot of fun. A lot of fun. Appreciate it. Thanks for having me. We'll see you next week if we can have anybody beat him. Thank you.